The first Lockerbie ice rink is now fully prepared for playing disability sports. Yes, it received funding throughout COVID to make the centre easier for those in wheelchairs to access. As James Mahan reports, coaches are now looking forward to welcoming new members. Lockerbie ice rink is open, accessible and ready for curling. I'm involved in tennis also uh, and we have the some, same problems. It's the facilities that are enabled sometimes to make things inclusive. But here at Lockerbie, since we had the previous grant, it's fully accessible now. The new office makes it easier for the players to go in rather than going upstairs. So as a club, we are fully accessible here now and, and that, that's a big deal. The grants to renovate and enhance the centre came from South of Scotland Enterprise and the Dumfrieshire East Community Benefit Group. Lockerbie Wheelchair Curling Club Secretary Isabel Cowan is grateful they now have a purpose-built home venue. Everybody's settled in quite nicely, weren't sure how it would work with Covid and new back. Because obviously uh, wheelchair curlers are slightly more at risk um, than the general population, but no, it's good. Participation numbers for disabled athletes have bounced back to pre-COVID numbers in Scotland, but coaches say the more the merrier. I became a coach in 2019 um, and we've worked with kids. I've worked a lot with visually impaired curlers, so I mean any disability, any ability can curl. You know, it's, it's there for everybody, whether you're on your feet, whether you're in the chair, uh, using a stick, not using a stick, everybody can have a go, you know. First-time curlers feel safe with new COVID safety protocols in place throughout the facility, including a first-time curler who was shielding during the pandemic. It really is important to get back out and get into the community to, to try and lead life as normal as possible. It's not going to go away, but unfortunately we're going to have to live with it. The National Curling Championships are happening in Kinross this weekend and players from all across Dumfries and Galloway are training in the hope of bringing back gold, silver and bronze over the coming days. James Mann, ITV News, Lockerbie.